Welcome to Mini Orange. Mini Orange provides single sign on solutions for crowd integrated Atlassian apps. And as we know, that is the best SSO solution available in the market. Let's see how SSO works with crowd integrated Atlassian apps. Here is the flow diagram of the SSO solution. The Crowd SAML SSO plugin is used to enable authentication for SAML IDP. Also to connect the Atlassian applications to IDP through Crowd, you will need to install the Crowd SSO connectors add-ons in the Atlassian applications. Using the SSO connector any user accessing that application gets redirected to IDP for SSO. Here all the SSO requests and responses to and from IDP will go through the Crowd server. The user authentication done by the IDP and Crowd still be used to manage the user permissions. It works with both server as well as data center apps. In your Crowd data center, go to your Mini Orange SAML SSO plugin. Now you are on Service Provider Info tab, we will be covering Azure AD setup here. You can also go through the setup on this guide, here you will get step-by-step -step instructions. Let's configure Azure AD as Identity Provider. Go to the Azure AD login page and log in with your credentials. Select Azure AD directory. Now go to Enterprise Application and click on New Application, then create your own application. Now enter the app name of your choice and click on Create. Your application created successfully. Now click on Setup Single Sign On. Click on SAML. Then click on Edit. For identifier URL, go to plugin and copy the SP Entity ID and paste it here. Similarly, for reply URL, copy the ACS URL and paste it. Click on Save. Now click on Edit. Then click on Add New Claim. Now enter the name of your choice. Then choose Name Format and select Claim Conditions. And click on Save. Now let's configure Crowd as Service Provider. Go to the Service Provider Info tab in the plugin. Scroll down and click on Next. You can configure the Identity Provider metadata either by manual configuration or by importing it metadata using URL of the metadata XML file. We will be configuring IDP metadata by navigating to Import from Metadata tab. Here enter the IDP name. You will find the metadata URL in your Azure AD application. Go to SAML Signing Certificates and copy the metadata URL and paste it and click on Import button. Then scroll down and click on Test Configuration. And you can see successful test configuration. You can also view the SAML request and response here. Now scroll up and go to User Profile tab. Here you can map the user profile attributes. Go to the email and enter the attributes as email. You can keep it as name ID as it contains email which was shown in the test configuration. Enter the first name attribute and last name attribute that we received in the SAML response. Now scroll done and click on save. Now let's configure Jira Crowd SSO connector. Navigate to Mini Orange Jira Crowd SSO plugin. In the SSO Configuration tab, enter the CrowdBase URL and click on Save. After updating SAML configuration, go to SSO Redirection tab if you want to force all your users to authenticate via IDP, then enable Auto Redirect to IDP option. Now click on Save. You can follow the same instructions of Jira Crowd SSO Connector configuration for configuring Crowd connectors for other Atlassian applications like Confluence. Bitbucket, Bamboo, and Fisheye. Let's see SSO in action for this apps. Go to Jira login page. You will be redirected to Azure AD login page for a SAML authentication by Jira Crowd Connector via Crowd. Now enter your Azure AD credentials. You will be successfully logged into Jira dashboard using Azure AD credentials. Go to the user profile to check the user data and you can see the user's full name and email ID here. User authentication is done by Azure AD, but user information is synced from the crowd. Mini Orange provide best single sign-on solutions. Thanks for watching.